I am still a virgin. <laughs> oh no. I'll eat the part that's not hairy. A few months ago, I made a video about a guy who'd never been with a woman. Virgins. Can't live with, can't, can't live with them. If you can't beat them, join them. And this video did extremely well, probably because it's an insane thought. I wonder what that jar smells like. I'm not no gonna way. make a sweater out of it. It's just a clump of belly button lint. Someone being so old yet never knowing what it's like to be with a man or a woman. In the first case, it was a guy. He'd never been with a, with a woman. He leaned into it heavily, had his own merch. Got Skippy? Huh? There's no way that this is real. There's literally no way that this guy has this many shirts. Honestly seemed like a really nice guy. Seemed like someone I would want to be with if I was a woman. Uh, which that's not true at all. I just lied. Today we're looking at the 41 year old is a virgin by accident, bro. Ah! Also a little forewarning, the way this thing ends is unexpected to say the least. This is weird, this is really strange. Oh, well we're starting off real f***ing quirky. Michelle is a 41 year old virgin by accident. Here's some clown music to really to really set the stage of this buffoon. They're so mean to people on TLC. They really, they really truly are. It's kind of sad, bro. It's kind of sad. I'm on Michelle's side so far. I feel like my virginity is not a choice so much as it is a um, an afterthought. She's Sigma grind set all day long. I mean, I respect where she's coming from. I can see that being like genuinely where I'm at right now, bro. If I never saw a set of breasts ever again in my entire life, I think I'd be all right. My virginity would eventually grow back and I'd be all right with that. Comment down below if you agree with me. Most people have the opportunity is in high school. I was a geek and a nerd and a little bit of a dork. Sure. Most people go to college. Same. I didn't. Say, wow, well, I went to college, but. I was perfectly happy to go home, watch some TV, maybe go to a movie on the weekend with my mom. So she's a bit of an enigma. Is she an incel? Uh, yeah, because that's just an involuntary celibate, right? That's also something I've, I've been wanting to make a video on for a long time is incels. There's like an incel wiki and stuff. It's really, it's really interesting. It's really, it's really an interesting topic, especially to me because I am a cell. No, 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 I'm not a cell. Yeah, I'm not. Yeah, I was. Yeah, no, I'm none of that. I've only kissed two men. I have never seen a man naked. <laughs> <laughs> I have never seen a man naked. <laughs> I've never held a woman or known a woman's touch. <laughs> you can just tell how embarrassed someone is about something by the, the reaction that they have when they say it. She's just she's laughing so uncomfortably when mentioning that she's never seen a man naked, bro. Kissing me at the end of the night, I was so scared. I, I, I literally threw up like the second time, our second date and the third date, the, almost the whole time. I don't know how I ate dinner. She's just throwing up like fucking Steve-O walking around. Yeah, dude. <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. People who throw up when they get nervous, because I get nervous a lot, right? I have a panic disorder. Had it for like 10 years now. So I get nervous constantly, all the time. I've never felt nauseous when I'm nervous though. Fortunately, thankfully. Let's have a round of applause for Jesus or whoever, you know? Yep. I do shit myself though. That's why I wear a diaper. I haven't set it up in my head that the first time has to be perfect. Ugh. Well, it doesn't, and it's not gonna be. There's something that needs to happen before Michelle can lose her virginity. She needs to, to, to go outdoors and visit, hang out with people more. I got the idea to do a coming out party because I just thought it would be a good way her. to get oh. everybody together and let them know, you know, that wow, she's a I'm still a virgin, you know? I, 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 I think, Michelle, I think that's a bad idea. I think you keep this, uh, well, actually you're on a TLC, you made a TLC show about it. Okay, yeah, she made a TLC. Yeah, so Shaw, I was figuring she, it might be better if she kind of laid low about the whole virginity thing and, you know, like kind of like left it up to the, the individual's opinion or either be like, I don't, you, you don't really see a 41 year old woman and generally be like, definitely a virgin. Definitely a virgin. Definitely throws up like Steve-O whenever she kisses men. I think you'd be good if you just never told anybody. 
But if you need to get it off your chest, I mean, I guess making a show about it is one way to do it. Part of me is maybe hoping that by getting it out there, I'll get some interest. I think that's how that works. <laughs> I feel like that might actually be, that's probably how it works for women, but for guys. <laughs> I think if I tell everyone I'm a virgin, I, I think I'll get some hits, bro. The biggest fear is definitely the secret. Hi! <laughs> is this one of our friends? Never wear horizontal stripes, by the way. Never wear horizontal stripes. If you want to be respected by me, don't wear stripes at all. But, but what are you doing? Are you, you conducting a train? Did you just escape from prison? Do you know about the party? I do. The act itself? You know, it's scary. I think I'm more afraid of telling someone. It, yeah, I'm just confused by this whole thing. I'm just confused by this whole thing. Being being someone who has copious amounts of uh, uh, copulation, I, I copulate copiously. What can I say? I'm a, you know, I'm a, I'm a cool guy. I'm a really cool guy. Mustache, you know, bedroom eyes. I don't think, I, this is, this seems like the wrong way to go about it though, is what I'm saying, basically. So, the secret is that even at the age that I am, which is 41, ouch, oh God. I am still a virgin. It'd be funny if she just started beating the f*** out of her, just, <laughs> why? Why'd you tell me that? <laughs> now I can't take it, <laughs> seriously. <laughs> I like to imagine fights in a lot of these TLC shows. Love imagining fights and, and boxing matches and other blasphemous things happening in these wacky, zany, informational learning shows. It was shock more than anything right. because she's an she's amazing so person. And <laughs> totally, I understand. I mean, huh? I'm a virgin as well. One reason I can relate like 150% with you, I'm a virgin as well. Oh my God. So There's no f way that this is f real, dude. Do you expect me to buy this TLC? It'd be funny though if she just said, just kidding, you suck, L plus ratio plus no maidens plus you're tarnished. Yeah? And then she moonwalked away. That'd be f Funny if she did that, but she didn't do that. She's also a virgin. There's no way. I refuse to believe it. Do you believe it? Do you actually believe that this is real? <laughs> it's fake. It is. It is That's fake. Awkward. It totally is. It must is. be fake. <laughs> That's really weird. Yeah. Aww. <laughs> okay. Oh, that just got a lot weirder. Okay. Let's see, see what I got. What the hell's that? Big virgin no cake? One. No way. Did you get a fucking virginity cake? Oh my goodness. It's a cherry. <laughs> All right. It's a cherry. That's sad. Uh, is very to the point. I don't get it. Why she got a maraschino cherry cake? Someone explain it to me in the comment section below. <laughs> Not in too much detail though. Comment probably won't make it through the filter. Michelle is coming out of the virginity closet at a formal dinner party. I Aww. am very nervous about tonight. I am. She looks so good. I'm definitely feeling tense. Wondering if people yeah, are even going to think. Not a big why deal. Why are you telling me this? Why is this important to you? You know, that's, yeah. that's part of it. Like, why did you bring me to this party and tell me this stupid thing? Who cares? I, I th honestly, I was about to say, I don't think, I don't think anyone's going to be mad at you if she was going to allude to the, the, the potential that the people coming to her party are going to be like turned off by her being a virgin or whatever and think she's stupid or less. Uh, but no, I think exactly what she just said is what will happen. Is this a virginity party? Hmm. Interesting. That's pretty cool, I guess. I, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to look at anybody um, because I don't know if I want to see the reaction. Yeah, especially that big stuff. I'm still nervous. When is she gonna say it? Heck for it. How is she gonna do this? <laughs> this is really strange. This is a compelling. She's created a party to announce her virginity. How? How the? F I'm assuming it's gonna end with her losing it. I hope so. So I wanted to admit it so that I can. Own it, control it. Um, what? I think that continuing to just sit here is going to make me more crazy. Yeah. So I, I, I'm starting to think I kind of I'm kind of getting why uh, why she's still a virgin here. I think I think I'm understanding some stuff here. This is crazy. She looks like someone. Oh, I, can't. I can't say who, but. What if she just flipped it on Kelly? Kelly has something she'd like to announce. We brought you all here.
Kelly's a virgin and she's a bitch. And also I, you know, I have a lot of boyfriends and, uh, you know, I love, I love their wieners and how hairy their balls are. I love how hairy and saggy their balls are. That's what my favorite part about this whole deal is, you know, the feet. Love feet too. I don't love feet. Don't take that out of context. Okay, so I guess it's done. Oh no. <laughs> so I know everybody's wondering why I brought you all here. Dude, no and, way. Uh, I just had something that I wanted to share. She ain't gonna um, tell everybody this. <laughs> From all these people. She's standing there so awkwardly. <laughs> I just wanted to say it and just kind of say it, it out and then be done with it. And Get I don't over want it! Feel. But, um, She's making me nervous. I am still a virgin. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh no. And now you guys understand the kink. Yeah. <laughs> you got it, right? I uh, this is I don't think that's a great idea. I'm still a virgin. I thought you were gonna say you're like pregnant or something like like Mother Mary, you know, no man, just baby inside, like baby Jesus or something. That's what you're going to say. Is, I, do I boo or do I heckle or? Having the secret out will make my dating life that easier. That funny looking. I, he looks like that picture of Vladimir Putin. <laughs> the one where like his side profile and he looks like a little smash, little pumpkin head or whatever. I think it's attractive for a man. It's very attractive. Mm. So you haven't found the right person. Yeah. What I'm looking for in a guy is how, how tall they make is me that feel. Guy? <laughs> if I'm a guy and I am meeting a virgin and and I don't know if I should be saying this one, but I'm just talking as a guy, right? I'm not yeah. talking as a husband. I'm talking as a guy. Maybe maybe stop talking then. That was a weird end. Holy shit! Thank you all for watching. Go ahead and watch this video as well if you enjoyed. Press the like button. Thank you all so much. And let's have a round of applause for your virginity.